So we all know that Prodigy has a habit of getting rid of things that people actually liked and not getting rid of things that people don't actually want. So here is a list of updates and things that I wish Prodigy would add to the game that would make it a whole lot more fun and that would definitely make me want to play more. So before we start this video please consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like this. So the first thing that I think Prodigy should add are quests for people who have already finished the quest. So as you, most of you know I'm on level 100 now and once you've kind of placed all the gems and stuff there's no like quests for people to do and there's kind of not really much you can do anymore so i think there should be more quests because then you just never get to see all the bok and even people again and i think it'd be fun if there would be more stuff that you can do for them that i would enjoy because i kind of miss just going on prodigy and meeting up with the little npc people and being told oh can you do this and get these papers and then battle this boss and do this and whatever. I really enjoyed that, like being told that I had to do something instead of just going on Prodigy and like walking around and doing a few battles or whatever. I think it would be a lot more interesting because once you finish all the quests, there's not really that much for you to do. Okay, number two is continuing the story. So ever since we saw the Puppet Master's defeat, um, there hasn't really been anything added to the story. All we've been told is something is something about the light dispelling the shadows or something like that. So we don't know when the next update is going to come. I obviously know that Prodigy is very busy and they may be working on an update right now, but I really hope something is going to come and the towers will be finally unlocked because they decided to lock the ice in the earth tower and it seems like they're going to be changing the story from what it was already. So I'm kind of excited for when they actually do that because I do want to know what is going to happen in like next for Prodigy because yeah I want to see all, all the towers unlocked and I definitely want to see what's in the astral tower so I hope they will be working on an update like that and we'll see like what happened with the puppet master after he died and whatever. Okay number three is the re-release of Harmony Island. So as we know um, when Prodigy got brought in that new battle update they got rid of Harmony Island and as of now it has still not been brought back so I'm not sure whether it's going to come back but I kind of wish it would because I loved Harmony Island, it was really fun and obviously we had we had the arena as well which has now just been left as an empty building with nothing in it and I haven't heard anything about it coming back. I did actually really enjoy the arena, it made me very competitive, I love getting the rewards from it, I had, I had some really good rewards, all the buddies and the armour and stuff. Um, now you can basically just buy the rewards from the arena from the, like the Landlight Town shops and stuff which I was pretty disappointed about since I did work hard to get a lot of those things but yeah I really hope they bring Harmony Island back at some point because it was something fun to do once you got to level 100 and everything and you didn't have any more quests to do. Okay number four is the release of a new island. Um, I don't particularly have any ideas on what island it could be but I just hope that Prodigy adds a new island at some point for something to do. They could easily just get rid of um, Tower Town and replace it with something else, a different quest, a different adventure, something to do for level 100s again like once you finish the game would definitely be good. Number five is an easier way to get Titan Shards. Uh, I've been trying to get the Titan power armor thing uh, for ages but the maximum amount of time charge you can get in a battle is four which is really annoying because it just takes forever i wish you could get a little bit more in a battle because i really want that outfit and i can't get it yet like i'm not even close so yeah i just have to keep doing these battles and get four each i think maybe it should be you get a time charge for every question you answer well that's just what i think anyways and number six rewards for the class leaderboard challenge so i know not everyone has this because not everyone's in a class but for most of the leaderboard challenges on the class leaderboard i have been in first place and not once have i been given the rewards that i was promised so when this update was released it did say that it will be giving rewards for these challenges and i have not been given a single reward 
despite coming first for pretty much every week so I don't know why they lied to me like that but I really do want some rewards for all that hard work and dedication I put into coming in first place and finally um release new mythical epics instead of just re-releasing the one so I know this has annoyed a lot of people um that they keep re-releasing already existing mythical epics instead of making new ones obviously it's not that annoying to me because I've only had my membership for since June last year so I haven't got all of the mythical epics yet but I, I noticed that a lot of people were pretty annoyed that Blast Star was re-released again this month and they've already got that instead of releasing a completely new mythical epic which I would also prefer like I know I haven't got Blast Star yet um, but I know a lot of people will have already got that from when it was previously released and I would definitely like to see a new uh, mythical epic released. So those are my thoughts for what I think should be added to Prodigy. Uh, let me know what you you think about that down in the comments. Uh, I'd like to see people's thoughts about what should be added and yeah that is the end of the video. If you did enjoy this video please subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.